So we're out here at Lake Norman for the 2014 CBC Championship. We got Mark Menendez with us, who's emceed the event for uh, yesterday and today. Mark, the bags today, I saw a lot of 10-pound bags, and you made a great point, and we talk about this every time we come to Norman. you got to get a four-pounder in the bag to compete, and the guys that did that today, they're in the top five. They certainly are, and it, and it largemouth did not show themselves this week. These colder temperatures kind of kicked that largemouth bite off. We only had one limit of largemouth weighed in. Now, the spotted bass fishery here is excelling. Lake Norman, when I first came, was called the Dead Sea. It's no longer that. It's a fine fishery with lots of bass, lots of places to get lots of good bites. But that largemouth bite was key. And we didn't see many big fish, but that two and a half to four pounder, if you could have a couple of those in your bag, they moved you up hundreds of spots in the standing. So that was critical this week. Well, I believe the, the gentleman that won, Scott Sellers and Randy Childers, I believe won. They had a four pound largemouth today. They had a three and a half or four pound spot yesterday. So, you know, as we said earlier, that won the tournament for them. Yeah, it was just, it's just a very minute difference between getting that, that four pound fish and a three pounder and it kicks them all the way to first place. It's gonna be a huge payout with that brand new Skeeter boat and Yamaha outboard. And that's the key here at Norman. Norman's a great tournament lake because it takes a lot of, lot of thought and a lot of uh, strategy to win here. It's easy to catch limits, but you've got to catch that big one to win. All right, now let's strategy, key, key word. Yesterday, the wind was blowing, bluebird skies. The bags were a little bit bigger. Today, the wind wasn't as strong, and everybody said that affected their, their ability to, to catch fish. That's true. And you, when we, th we think about wind, the wind is always your friend. I love a windy day. It positions the bass. It makes them move shallower. And I saw a lot more of those three and a quarter to four pound spotted bass yesterday. Today we didn't have that and those fish never slid shallow. So it didn't position them where those guys could catch them very easy. Moving baits, swim baits, spinner baits, those kind of things where the where caught those fish yesterday. Back to this dock skipping techniques, getting back there a little further than everybody else. I was hoping to see more largemouth, but this cold snap just kind of turned them off. But um, what a great fishery this is and the CBC is one of the best tournament circuits that I know of where the anglers come in, pay their entry fees, and fish for more money above and beyond their entry doesn't happen. That's yeah, no, it doesn't. Hey, folks, we're going to talk to the champions in just a bit.